Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And so today, um, we are going to be um, doing a tier list of NHL teams. So last time we did um, WHL teams, which is the Western Hockey League, but now we're doing the NHL ones. They have more teams than the WHL has. So yeah, let's let's get started. So first off, we're gonna we're gonna rank the Anaheim Ducks. So, basically, I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna put them, like, lower than C tier because I don't really like the Anaheim Ducks. Probably, probably E tier. Yeah, or, I don't like them. Um, next we have the Arizona Coyotes, easily S tier, even though they, even though they suck a lot, they, they're still... They're still good. Um, I'm gonna say the Coyotes. Um, Jared Davidson, um, my favorite um, Seattle Thunderbirds player. Uh, actually, hockey player. My favorite hockey player of all time. Um, he is... He almost got into the Arizona Coyotes. That was like his most likely team was gonna go, but like, thankfully he wasn't. He would, he made it to a team. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you yet, but the team is a lot better than the Coyotes. So yeah. Um, next up we have the Bruins. I'll put them C tier because they're they're okay. Um, yeah, they're good. Next we have the Buffalo Sabres. I don't know I don't know much about them, but I mean I mean they are a team in New York. I mean I guess they're okay. I don't know. I don't know about them. But yeah. Next up we have the Calgary Flames. So they share an arena with um a WHL team which is the Calgary Hitman. Um and I say that's kind of cool. Yeah, um, I'm probably gonna put them in B tier. Just yeah, um, Carolina Hurricanes much better as the Hartford Whalers. Um, I, I think the Hurricanes should go to C tier. They're also an okay team. Yeah, um. Next up, we have the Chicago Blackhawks, easily an S-tier team. Um, Kevin Korchinski is going to play for that team in the future, so, yeah. Next up, we have the Colorado Avalanche. The, um, this team is the Stanley Cup champions of, 20, of 2022. Sorry, my grammar. Um... I I say easily A tier. They they're good. Um okay, Columbus Blue Jackets. Um one of my favorite hockey YouTubers, Nasher is a fan of them, so I'll put it above C tier just B. Um they had Rick Nash. That's why that's why I like him. Um, next we have the Dallas Stars, um, Connor Roulette will be playing for that team soon, so that's easily an, an A tier team. Um, next up we have the Detroit Red Wings. The Red Wings are a legendary NHL team, like easily an A tier, I like, um, Next up, we have the Edmonton Oilers, the one of the best teams in the W, no, not WHL, NHL. Um, they have, they have freaking Connor McDavid, which is the fastest and the best hockey player, um, in in NHL. Um, yeah, and Reed Schaefer will be playing for the Oilers. Um, when, when he wants to, when he wants to, well, that's weird, anyway, um, next up, 
is the Florida Panthers. Panthers, I don't know much about. I I say they're D tier. I don't. I'm not really a fan of them. Um, the L A Kings is A tier. I say. Um, Wayne Gretzky used to play for this team. Um, they also, they also used to be very good. Um, in 2014, or like under 2015 or something, they won the Stanley Cup in 2012 and 14. So it was really cool to to see. So yeah, that's why I'm putting them in A tier. Next up, we have the Minnesota Wild. The Wild, um, yeah, I don't really know much about the Wild either, um, but uh, I say they're an okay C tier team. Um, next up is Montreal Canadiens, um, easily S tier. So this is a team that Jared Davidson will be playing um, in the 2023 to 24 season, NHL season. So yeah, it's a really it was really cool to see Jared Davidson be part of the Montreal Canadiens. An absolutely good team also. They won the most Stanley Cups. Um, uh, 23 is a lot. Nashville Predators. Probably the most unsportsmanlike team. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to put them below C tier. I don't like, I don't really like the Predators that much. They have, and they're just, they're just super unsportsmanlike. The Devils, like the, the team mascot, I mean, well, not mascot, but like, I like the team theme. The, yeah, the theme is just Devils. I like, I like the Devils. Yeah. Um, New York Islanders is definitely an S tier team because because Matthew Barzell plays for that team. Yeah, Barzell used to be a Seattle Thunderbird, and he and he was a really good person, a really good player. He um he helps the Thunderbirds win uh win the 2017 Ed China with Cup. Um, so that's why I'm putting them in S tier because of Barzal. Next up, we have the Rangers. The Rangers are also an S tier team. Um, because Matthew Rempe, or Rempe, I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, he, Matthew Rempe is going to play for the New York Rangers soon which is which is awesome I can't wait to see him play for that team Rempe yeah Rempe got one of the most popular teams of the, the WHL um, the Ottawa Senators are an okay team as well S tier yeah because they're this team is good. I this team's okay. Just okay. I don't really know much about them. Next up we have the Philadelphia Flyers. I'm gonna put them in D tier because they are it's a team that Sidney Crosby hates. Yeah, Sidney Crosby's the least favorite team. Speaking of Sidney Crosby, the Pittsburgh Penguins. Um, um, so, so the Pittsburgh Penguins are going on S tier because, um, because Sidney Crosby and Lucas Fakovsky are are going to play for that team. Yeah, next season, and this season, Lucas Fakovsky is going to be in the Pittsburgh Penguins. So that is really cool to see that. So, it's awesome. Um, next up, we have the San Jose Sharks. So, I'm going to put them up at A tier because 
um, one time when they were playing against the Vegas Golden Knights. Um, in the third period, they were just down. But then the Sharks got Vegas Golden Knights to choke very easily. They're, oh my gosh, they literally beat the Vegas Golden Knights in overtime. And then just won the game. It was a huge comeback I've ever seen. I mean, it was the hugest comeback I've ever seen. Like, that's why that's why I'm putting them in A tier for that. Because I just want to give them credit. Um, the Seattle Kraken, bro. Easily the S tier. I mean, it, I mean, it makes sense to put them in S tier. Because I live in Washington and it's my favorite team of of the NHL that's the Seattle Kraken is easily the S tier like seriously like nothing beats the Kraken yeah just put them up there seriously um next up we have the St. Louis Blues um I i I don't know much about them either, um, but they are they are a pretty good team. I heard. Oh no, not F tier. I would not put them there. Um, I'll just put them in B tier, not really C tier because they're an okay team. I, I don't know much about them. Actually, I I like the look alike thing. They look like Cam, so I'm putting them up here. Um, next up we have the Tampa Bay Lightning. So, believe it or not, my school is the... My school mascot is the Liberty Lightning. Um, yeah. Lightning. It's lightning. I'm like... Yeah, I mean... I'm just gonna put them um, probably D tier because I don't like the Tampa Bay Lightning. Yeah, but my school, I get, I just cheer them on. Honestly. Um, next up, Toronto Maple Leafs. Uh, the team Austin Matthews plays on. I'll put them in A tier because they're a good team. I'm just, just gonna say. Like, um, next up, we have the Vancouver Canucks. Um, this is easily my least favorite team. It's the Seattle Kraken rival. Um, yeah, their biggest rival is the Vancouver Canucks, and I don't like them. I don't like the Vancouver Canucks. They're, they're an F-tier team. <clears throat> oh, gosh. All right, next up is uh, the Vegas Golden Knights. So, the Vegas Golden Knights is going on S tier because um, a Seattle Thunderbird is also playing for the for the Golden Knights, um, and that is Jordan Gustafson. Yeah, Jordan Gustafson is one of my favorite players. He gave me a puck. I can actually go get it. This is the puck that Jordan Gustafson gave me. I'm really thankful for that. It's he's he's an awesome player. Yeah, I'm putting him in S tier. Next up is the Washington Capitals, also going on the S tier because um, Henrik Rubinsky is also going to play for that team. Oh my gosh! Yeah, Henrik Rubinsky is gonna play for that team. Um, he he outaged for the WHL now, so now he plays for the Washington Capitals. Um, next up, oh no, no, last is the Winnipeg Jets. The Winnipeg Jets are also going on the S tier. And why do I put most of them on the S tier? Well. 
most of the Thunderbirds players are are easily are easily the team that that the they're going on. And the Winnipeg Jets also has a Seattle Thunderbird that will play for them in the future. And it's my second favorite player, Tyrell Bauer. So yeah. Tower Bauer is a legend. Um, he's awesome. So yeah, that's why I'm putting him. That's why I'm putting his future team in S tier, and in all the future teams. So yeah, that's so that's pretty much it for the the tier list. Um, if you have enjoyed, please. Leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.